Is this the office building of the future? New Office, as it's called, is considered to be one of the most sustainable office buildings in the world. It uses energy efficient heating, cooling, ventilation, and lighting and aims to minimize its environmental impact. The building in Munich was completed in November 2012. Taking a look back at the construction process reveals some of its eco friendly features. One of the building's energy saving secrets is hidden inside its walls. Hubert Haupt is the owner of the building. We have thick exterior walls, so we don't have to cool in the summertime and we don't need to heat a lot during the winter months, which reduces the tenants' energy expenses. We have worked intensively with simulations, especially in terms of where we place the windows, because we wanted the energy output to be ideal and at the same time to have enough daylight in the building. There were many details we had to consider within the broad theme of sustainability. Also es waren viele Details, die wir bei dem Thema Nachhaltigkeit da berücksichtigt haben. Turning away from the glass-walled style of office buildings that have been popular in recent years, the windows at New Office are more modest in size and triple glazed. This means cooler interiors on hot days, reducing the need for air conditioning, and less heating on cooler days. But the building's greatest secret is found in its basement an innovative new heating system. The building's engineer, Romano Schillinger, oversaw the progress of its construction. Tube loops inside the thermoactive ceiling enable us to regulate the temperature inside the concrete. Heating or cooling the mass of concrete from the core results in a consistent warming or cooling of the rooms. Additionally, the office is connected to district heating in the wintertime. In the summer, well water is used for cooling. Electricity power is given a boost by these solar panels on the roof. Michael Krauss and his team from the Fraunhofer Institute of Building Physics developed the energy concept. Now, since the building has been completed and is in operation, we can measure the energy usage and calculate the energy efficiency of the building. Sensors measure the temperature and air humidity both inside and outside of the building. This data is used to regulate the indoor climate. At the end of the year, we expect a primary energy consumption of about 30 kilowatt hours per square meter per year. Conventional new office buildings, which don't have any ambitions concerning energy savings, range between 100 and 150 kilowatt hours per square meter each year. And the low energy consumption of the building has other benefits too. With local energy prices jumping by over 50% in the last 10 years, green buildings are a welcome solution to rising costs. Good for the bottom line and the environment.